Hello there, I'm Mafia and I'm back with some more Ticket. So today I'll be continuing my wonderful plan and um, well, right now I managed to make myself uh, my first diamond. It's an artificial diamond, but it's a diamond nonetheless. nonetheless. Um, so uh, what I want to do right now is uh, go to the nether now because I have some redstone, I have the diamond, but I do not have uh, what's it called some glowstone to make myself a philosopher's stone. So there's only one place I can go to get it. So what uh, can I take? Nothing here. But uh, so I have a little plan. As uh, so for that, I'll need to actually put some sand to burn. Uh, but uh, I'm putting some refined iron too. But uh, my first part. Uh, it's actually non has nothing to do with the uh, or with my whole brilliant plan. It's uh, just I'm going to make some refined iron because I want to make a machine. And I forgot what it is. Oh yeah, that's it. I want to make myself a better um, machine for uh, for energy. I want to make myself a geothermal generator and uh, to make that I need uh, some glass, some refined iron, a generator and two empty cells. So now I have the refined iron I need the sand. So I'll put this to burn and uh, we just have to wait now. Uh, but in the meantime I'm just going to show a few recipes. Uh, with cactus green I'm going to make some waterproof it's always useful to have and uh, I will need it eventually uh, to waterproof my cobblestone pipes so there we go have some fully waterproof pipes and I'll use that well use those and probably not so soon but eventually to um, actually move some lava to a better storage place because I do want to fully um, exploit those volcanoes also, at some point I will do something with this computer. My plan is to get some diamonds so I can make myself a turtle, uh, which will be then upgraded to a mining turtle. And this mining turtle, uh, which is uh, then going to be used basically as a quarry, because uh, it works pretty much the same, and it uh, is, uh, well, it's much cheaper actually, so it's the choice is very easily done, I suppose. So I have my computer, that's all. But I, I'm still missing some diamonds and uh, I'm too lazy frankly to go through the all industrial, well go through the process of industrial crafting, I don't know. Or making industrial uh, diamond that took ages. So I'm not really doing that uh, so soon. But what I'm going to do now is make uh, the, that a tank. And with a tank, I'm going to attach this to a mining well. And this makes a pump. This is going to allow me to uh, well, gather the lava from the, from the volcano. And uh, usually volcanoes do descend pretty far down. So it's always a good thing uh, since I am going to need quite a decent amount of lava in the near future. So, I need another one of those, however, or another tank however, to actually store the lava, because otherwise it will ju probably just spill everywhere if I didn't do anything. And uh, I think I'll put this pump uh, not in on the volcano which is just above me, but on the other one, because um, I do you remember a specific tragedy which happened? I don't recall um, actually mentioning that, but when I arrived and I dig, I decided to make this in my home. I started digging and eventually I heard some lava bubbling out and I just decided to check it out and uh, I saw the lava get well. Just a few more seconds and I would have been probably trapped inside the house. So it was was well something I would suppose. Uh, do I have anything else to put? Never mind. I'll just waste this coal. Never mind. 
Um, let's make the other tank. Get this the generator over there. Oh, and by the way, one thing. Um, well, this generator can be broken, but any other industrial craft machine, if you break it um, with a pickaxe, it will uh, drop a machine block normally. If, uh, why am I going to furnace a generator? That's, that makes no sense. So I need the recipe. I want. No, I, I want to know what to do with. So I'm not going to do this yet. Not a water mill. I can't wait to reach solar energy. That's always going to be good. Nuclear is pretty dang good too. So geothermal. I have the glass, refined iron. Oh, I think I may not have enough glass. Ah, shit. So I have the generator and uh, I need some empty cells. Let's. Oh, damn it. But yeah, to make the empty cells very easy, you just need to make this shape with some tin, tin uh, ingots, and there you have it. And of course I'm missing some sand. So I will, I'll be right back. See you later. Okay, I'm finally back. I have uh, the piece of sand, which was probably two seconds for you. It was more like 20 for me. Never mind. Uh, it's the magic of transition, I suppose. So now I hope I have all I need. I have my generator. I have my two empty cells. I have some refined iron, of course. And finally, I have the glass. So let's hope this works. Yes, it does. So the geothermal generator is basically a normal generator. But with it works only with lava. Uh, the good thing of that is that it uh, produces some engines that energy for quite a long time and uh, it's pretty powerful so it's a good thing to have I suppose. Now then, uh, I have a pump, I can put it down, I, f I feel like I'm forgetting something. Oh I know, I, have, I know, I know. Let's take some coal stone just to make the lava port, uh, or the ender portal. And, uh, what the hell? Now I can actually go to sleep, because tomorrow is going to be a long day. Now then, let's head to the volcano. Oh, dang, it's getting so much lag. Uh, okay. So the way I'm going to proceed is I'm going to uh, put the oh cool dang it I'm going to put the pump down uh, just above the hole in the volcano and uh, it will just well, get the get the good stuff for me so I can see the hole right there let's put a piece of cobblestone here just like that. Then I will be probably needing my generators and my pump and also my lead. Always a good thing to have. Let's put the thing right here. Oh come on. Motor number what well, engine number one here, engine number two there. Lever here. Also, it could be a good idea to actually put the tank. Okay, excellent. Now I am ready to get started. Let's do that too. So now I should start a... Yeah, you can see the lava going up. Just um, as required. So... Now what do I need? I need a bucket. And... Uh, yeah, that's all. So let's put the port right there, that should be okay. Next I need some lava which I'll collect here. Excellent. I think I'll skip the rest of uh, making the portal because 
voice is gonna take some ages. So, um, see you then. Okay, I'm back. So, uh, I had to come back to my home. Well, first of all, because I took some extra lava in buckets, so that will be useful for the geothermal genera generator. And also, I had to make myself a flint and steel. So, well, or flint and tinder, whatever. So, now I have it. It's time to activate the portal. What the hell? <laughs> that scared the shit out of me. Jeez. I probably put some on the floor. Okay, let's carefully go inside. And hopefully everything is going to be okay. I'm sorry I had to skip this uh, piece of footage from the Never. It uh, just was unbearably laggy. Like, one or two FPS, that's... Um, just unacceptable for video quality. I trust you understand this. Uh, but anyway, now I have uh, well sufficient amount of glowstone. I hope. So now I'll be able to make myself a philosopher's stone, and this is going to solve all my problems. So I need my diamond, and I need what else? So yeah, I put the diamond in the middle, uh, glowstone there, it can also be in the corners, it doesn't really matter, both recipes work. Alright, so there you go, we have the Philosopher's Stone and now starts a new era in uh, my Take It series, um, an era of, of abundance, but uh, I do not have a diamond, that's an it's been annoying. So one thing I'm going to do is I'm actually going to uh, well put well cook some gold and and there oh sh yes but yeah as I told you I have some buckets there we go that will allow me to well put some lava in uh, this lovely little geothermal generator. There we go here and it's it's working. What else could I work? What? No, what else could I ask? I mean... Uh, okay. So... So, yeah. <laughs> There's not much I have to do right now besides wait. So. Okay, now that I have four... Um, full dust I guess. I'll just put this to burn because uh, with equivalent exchange if you put uh, I think it's one gold is equivalent to no wait no one diamond is equivalent to three four gold. Ah dang it. So um, I hope it does work with a philosopher's stone. I'm not certain about that. If it doesn't, it would be um, mostly, well, quite annoying. Actually, one thing I could do next is actually making myself a an electric furnace. So that will be that will be a good moment. Okay, so that's moment of troop. This is a shapeless uh, recipe, so you can put the stuff pretty much anywhere. Oh yeah, I get my diamond. Uh, wonderful, I get my philoso philosophically produced diamond now. This is uh, my second achievement. Achievement get, uh, I suppose. Uh, so now I have a diamond, what should I do with that? Um, num, num, num. I think I can make a... Ah, damn it. What can I make with a Philosopher's Stone? Okay, oh I need some obsidian. Uh, maybe I could equivalent exchange that, hopefully. Shapeless man. Ah, no. I guess I have to collect it manually, so. So yeah, well at least I have my diamond. That's, that's good news, right? Let's get those. 
I'm actually quite annoyed right now because I ended up having to make myself an iron pick, you know, a diamond pickaxe in fact. Uh, so that's not ideal because now I don't have any diamonds. But at least I'll be able more to make myself my transmutation table uh, if I collect the. What is it worth? Ah, dang it! If I collect at least two obsidian from uh, what was a nether portal. Because I don't think I'll be needing it um, anytime soon. So, it is time to say goodbye. So, let's break this. Okay, wonderful. I have, um, well, enough obsidian now. I g just got one extra one uh, just for the sake of transmutation. It's always, a, it's always useful, I would suppose. Uh, but yeah. Oh dang it, I don't have any more, any more gold. Uh, yeah, that's going to be quite tricky to get the next diamond. I have a slight idea, but uh, it's going to be a bit annoying. Anyway, um, next part of the plan is uh, getting those and putting a bit of uh, stone to burn. But actually, I forgot whether it's cobblestone or not cobblestone. Ah, oh, god damn it. I don't know why the recipes don't seem to be working extremely well from time to time. I have no idea why. So yeah, it is some stone I need though. So, let's I'll put eight as well. And just wait until uh, at least full burn and I'll finally be able to make myself a transmutation table. Yay. Next, let's uh, actually do the recipe itself. So I believe it's uh, the four, four stones in the corners. Those here and those there. And I was wrong! Hey, hey! It was actually the obsidian in the corners. And they have an, uh, well, a transmutation tablet. So let's put the tablet, I don't know, over the furnace. And basically, the transmutation tablet is has this little interface. And uh, whatever you put in, well, well, every item almost have an EMC value. So it's basically a value, and the more valuable the, um, the object, the greater the value, I suppose. So let, let's put actually never act to burn here. So it will convert the matter into EMC, like that. Uh, so let's just put a whole bunch of crap in here. Uh, but what I want is to actually get a diamond. So I'll... I have no idea on how to do that. So uh, just slightly more we have eight iron here. First of all I have to make it memorize. The yeah, there you go. It memorized the iron ingots and now if I uh, use the Philosopher's Stone I can craft a uh, a gold ingot. There you go. Then I can make it memorize the gold ingot, like that. And uh, I want to collect three more, so I have a whole bunch of gems in here. I'll, I'll just probably use those. So let's memorize this, memorize that, memorize that. And one, two, three. I still have a bit of EMC in the in the tablet, so that's okay. Let's make our diamond. Excellent. And uh, finally, we can actually put the diamond to memorize like that. So it has been learned, and uh, yeah, now I have. Three diamonds, just take I'll be back.
Sorry for that, I am back. I uh, just had a call and I uh, had to answer, and from what I've heard it was actually well, a bit urgent. But anyway, let's get one gold just for the sake of hanging it. And save the rest in uh, iron ingots. Might as well. So, and let's store them in this chest. So the gold goes there. Iron goes there, and... So, yeah, that's all. <laughs> uh, oh yeah, lapis is actually... Lapis is really, really valuable. So with that I'll be able to get tons of diamonds, but... Uh, uh, I won't worry about that quite yet, uh, because that's probably way enough for today's video. So I guess I'll be seeing you next time. Um, so if you enjoyed, please like, and subscribe, or any of those. If you have any suggestions, any ideas, uh, criticism, whatever, let me know by posting a comment. Uh, don't be too harsh though. And uh, since this is the end, I'll be saying goodbye.